warning today from public health experts. We learn more about this virus transmitted by mosquitoes. It appears to be spreading explosively now around the world. Now, the World Health Organization is meeting next week to discuss the danger of the spread, especially for pregnant women. Local 12 medical reporter Liz Bonus has been following the story today. She joins us now with more about one more thing we're all learning about, one more thing we have to worry about, Liz. Boy, so true. A lot unfolding on this today. This virus known as the Zika virus, especially dangerous to those who are pregnant because if mom gets it, she can pass it to baby and babies can have long term complications and even die from it. Now, the World Health Organization, as you, as you mentioned, has set up an emergency meeting. It will happen next week. It's on this virus. They're going to address the spread and perhaps a rush to development of a vaccine for it. It is now in as many as 23 countries, has shown up here in the United States in at least a few people who've traveled to some of those infected countries, such as Brazil. Now, we did talk to experts at TriHealth today. As you mentioned, it's transmitted through mosquito bites. And for those of us not pregnant, it's a virus, not especially dangerous. We might not even show symptoms or know if we have it. But we talked to Dr. Sylvania Ng. Today, she's an infection control expert at TriHealth. She says for pregnant women, that is not the case. She's recommending women who are pregnant change travel plans to infected countries until we know more about this. The typical symptoms for us might be red eyes, fever, and joint pain. And however, there is some reports and link of this viral illness, especially pregnant patients uh, with, with children that are born, babies that are born with some um, neurologic deficits and small heads, what's called microcephaly. And that's of great concern. So that said, here is what you need to know. You need to stop mosquito bites to stop the spread. If you're pregnant and you've traveled to one of the infected countries, you are likely going to need lab tests or imaging to know if something is wrong with a baby. There is currently no vaccine for this, but the World Health Organization is saying they do hope to launch a study on one this year. The CDC says right now they may have something to combat the infection within the next few years, but they're still working on it. If you'd like a list of travel de destinations to avoid, go to local12.com, hover on the news tab, click on the Get It Now links. Just watching mm. things change on this today, the most interesting thing was that they found something that would almost like make the virus die. And that's what they think we might be able to sort of advance make, but that would be in the form of a pill or something like that, that you would hope you would get out to people in these countries that it's really spreading rapidly. Wow. Gonna come back at 5.30 and we have a local family, they decided they're canceling their trip. You know, it's been a tough decision to make. It was gonna be their dream trip, wow. just can't go.